We're Ashley McGibbon with Women's Division II, Paris Wegleitner from Northern Michigan University. Thanks for coming on 5 Minute Major. Thank you for having me. Only four girls on your team have ever been to nationals. What's the experience been like for the other ladies? I think it's just fun for them to get to come here. We didn't really expect that we would be here after our time at playoffs um, two weekends ago. So I think it's just good to get them. We're kind of in a rebuild for our program to get them experience coming here for their future three, three years that the freshmen, I guess, have left. When you finally got the invitation to come to nationals, how did you secure all of the things necessary financially and otherwise to, to be ready to make the journey to St. Louis? It was, we found out Monday night that we were going and we actually had spring break last week so we didn't practice at all last week before. It was kind of a mad like rush to like get our busing then like go on the link to get all of our hotels and kind of get everything squared away in such like short time. So it was kind of a big like rush to get. We were just lucky that we financially had fundraised enough throughout the year that we weren't in like kind of trouble knowing that we were going to get here. Do, do you like the opportunity to encounter teams that you would not have normally through the through the regular season? Yes, I think because we play in the CCWHA, which we have the set teams that we need to play. And otherwise we'd never play like tonight we play Boston College. We never play them in a regular regular season game. For yourself, tonight's the last game of your college career. Made it to two national championships. Um, how cool is it going to be to potentially go out on a winning note? Yeah, no, it'd be really cool. I, majority of people, I think, you know, their last game of their careers, they typically don't have the opportunity to win the game unless they win the whole championship. So I think it's kind of a unique opportunity to be able to go out and a win. As the captain, do you like the opportunity that pool play provides your come down? I mean, it's how many hours from, from the UP down here? It was like a 11 hour drive down here. So 11 hours to get down here and you're guaranteed at least three games in pool play. Is, is, do you think that's an important aspect of? I think so, because if it was like a one and done kind of game, it would be a lot on a school to travel 11 hours down here and just be a one and done game. So I think our team likes that like, even if we do lose that first game, that we still are here for two other games for that. What do you think it does for your hockey program with the exposure that you have at national tournament in terms of recruiting, in terms of scheduling for next year? Well, I think it's huge to be able to say that you went to nationals just for recruiting any team wants, they, any player wants to come to a winning team. They don't want to come to some team that like wins like one, two games. To be able to show that you made it to nationals is a huge selling point for your school. When nationals is over and, and, and you head back, how, how, how do you think the um, ACHA fills a void for women, especially in Michigan, to be able to continue with education, but then also to compete and play in the game they love, which is, uh, you know, ice hockey? I just think they got to continue promoting it, growing it. Um, even the time, the three years that I've been on the team, I've seen it grow a ton. A ton of teams have really built up their programs. And I think just continued support from everyone involved. Well, hey, want to wish you the best of luck. Uh, congratulations on a collegiate career and uh, well, welcome back to Nationals. Thank you. This is Paris Wegleitner, Northern Michigan University, Women's Division II, 2024 National Championship.